Hey everyone, it's Gavin Burseff, your Myrtle Beach real estate expert, back at it with another weekly video. And today I'm about to show you one of the most sought after communities in the Grand Strand, known as the Bluffs on the Waterway. If rather, if you're someone that is looking for waterway living, some incredible amenities, or a convenient location where you have everything that Myrtle Beach has to offer, this could be the perfect spot for you. The Bluffs on the Waterway is a gated community on the Intercoastal Waterway. And the moment you go through those gates, you realize the exclusivity and the elegance throughout the neighborhood. With many of the homes having waterway views, private docks, and some top-notch finishes as well. But when it comes to homes here, there's a variety of designs, with a lot of them having that nice Mediterranean design architecture or a nice con contemporary design as well. Homes here range from anywhere from 2,000 to up to 6,000 square feet. And the nice thing is a lot of them have larger lots, perfect for entertaining. But let's go back to the amenities. At Bluffs on the Waterway, they got some top-notch amenities, such as two clubhouses, a resort-style swimming pool, tennis courts, and a, and a playground perfect for children. But that's not what makes the amenities unique at the Bluffs. What makes it unique is it does have a private boat storage and a community boat ramp. So if you're someone that enjoys going out on the water, this is the perfect community to do that. Because the nice thing, just imagine, you can take your boat, your boat out in your own community start cruising on the intercoastal waterway if you're rather if you're someone that enjoys fishing water sports or you just want enjoy catching those south carolina sunsets this is definitely the lifestyle right here but the nice thing about the bluffs is not just its amenities but the location because we all know location is key the bluffs on the waterway is located near all the greatest shops restaurants and entertainment and the best part you're still a short drive to the beach but the nice thing is we're going to be taking a look at a current listing but before we go on inside if you guys have any questions about this community want to schedule a personal tour or want to explore similar options like the bluffs feel free to reach reach out to me all my information is going to be in the description below so feel free to give me a call text or email and or schedule one-on-one -on -one consultation i'm happy to help but let's go on inside and take a look at this current listing so we are at a current listing here which is at 2021 hideaway point which is listed by my fellow agent brian osborne from innovate real estate and this is a five bedroom four bathroom home with about 3,500 heated square feet with a total of 4,000 500 square feet but the nice thing about this home it does have a nice mediterranean design has a great curb appeal and it's a bigger lot with it being almost over a quarter of an acre too uh, but i can't wait for you guys to enter this amazing home right here and as you can see it does have the double entry doors right when you walk in and check this out as you enter you have a nice open floor concept. The one thing I love is all the nice luxury upgrades they have done to the home with the wooden accents throughout the, uh, throughout the whole home. They do have tray ceilings in a lot of the areas too uh, with the crown molding as well. Uh, but this is a great home right here. It does have the nice hardwood flooring as well. But we're gonna be t turning to the right and taking a look at the first two bedrooms. Uh, the first bedroom we're going to look at is they are using it as an office. So look at this. This is a, a I you know think it's a great office space. Again, you can see the wooden accents as well. You do have the closet over there, and then to our right is our first full bathroom. Got the nice tile uh, shower too, tub shower. Again, you have your second bedroom got two closets in here uh, the one thing to point out too is they do have the plantation shutters throughout the whole main living area again tray ceilings as well and then we're going to be heading this way um, be, and we're going to be making a left um, so this is going to be the garage space right here you do got a nice two-car garage as well you cannot go wrong with that and then the nice thing what I like about that is you do have a drop zone so you can put your shoes, your jackets, um, right when you know you get home from work or you know having a fun day at the beach. And we have our third bedroom right here, which is a nice size. All these bedrooms I would say are oversized too, which is nice. And then we got our second full bathroom as well. 
Again, very similar to the first bathroom when it comes to the, the tub and shower. And then we'll be going this way. The nice thing about this home is you do have a lot of closet space too. So you got one right here to store some things, another one right here as well. So not too bad. But we're gonna keep on going this way. Again, we're gonna maybe making another left. And as you can see, we got another closet space as well. And you do have this an amazing utility room with tons of cabinet space, counter space, and you do have this amazing utility sink too. Uh, this is you know definitely luxury at its finest. And definitely nice tiles in here too. But now we're gonna be taking another left. And as you can see, some of the nice things I wanna point, uh, point out with the touches, of course you got the wooden accents, but a lot of these entryways, you do have the nice arches too. So I just like the design features in this home as well. But you're greeted to a massive living room area, dining room area, and kitchen area with an oversized kitchen. This is definitely people's dream kitchen. It feels like you just took it out of an HGTV magazine uh, with, you know, gray countertops. It, this kitchen is, you know, a, a chef's dream right here. Uh, and I love how it just connects into the whole room. You got a, a massive dining room table here, but it does not, you know, take up the room either. Same for the living room area too. Uh, but the nice things I want to point out too is you do got like a the wine cooler over there too if you you know if you like to drink some wine and you got this an amazing pantry right here and this I mean this can't get any better than what you're seeing here and then some other things too is I want to point out as you again you got the tray tray ceilings even in the family room you got coffered ceilings too with a gas fireplace uh, same for the gas stove as well but a massive room I mean this is definitely uh, you know, luxury at its finest. But now let's go, now let's go check out the outdoor area. I gotta say, this is definitely some, you know, some nice place to relax to right back here. And they have, the nice thing is they got a little TV set up right here and streamed in as well. You do have a nice little barbecue area with granite countertops. Um, and then of course you can see you got a nice size yard right here. Where if you, you know, you wanted to add a pool, you could, you know, add a pool if you wanted to. Uh, but this is definitely, you know, a nice sized yard. But let's go back inside and take a look at the rest of the house. And you follow me this way as we take a look at the owner's suite. And as you can tell, this is a massive owner's suite again you got the tray ceilings uh you got very tall ceilings in this room as well but this is just a, a crazy size owner's suite you got you know a nice size bed nightstands you got the whole set right here and it it's you know you still got a lot of room and then you're going to be going to your owner's suite bathroom this is definitely people's dream bathroom with the double vanity sinks and as well, you got a soaker tub right here, and you got a nice European style shower, uh, walk-in shower with you know the double uh, shower heads as well, with a nice size owner suite closet to you know have all your nice shoes, clothes, whatever you name it. And of course, you got your wet closet over here. Uh, but this is definitely a nice home. Again, I did not say earlier, but the home is priced at $9.98, so just under a million. Uh, great home at the Bluffs. And the nice things too, we already looked at four bedrooms, but we're gonna be taking a look upstairs. And the nice thing is what I like about upstairs is, the again, the wooden accents all the way going up. And then you're gonna be um, have an, uh, another bedroom if you want or game room but before we take a look at the other bedroom we're gonna look at some storage options here too this is the one thing I really love about this home is the amount of storage because uh, I know a lot of people that are maybe moving from up north you're used to basements and you come here you don't got that so you you know nice thing for that you have plenty of storage up here too but check this out this is considered the fifth bedroom but as you can see you can make this a nice game room. 
bonus living room area. Um, or if you have, you know, a lot of friends or family coming, this could be, you know, a place where they, you know, come visit and, you know, be kind of have that little separation between where, you know, where you are and then where your guests are gonna be as well. And you do got a closet space right here. And so yeah, nice, another nice size closet. But you know, a great, great, great size room right here. And again, another full bathroom with a total of four bathrooms here. And, and again, you got some more storage as well. So you cannot go wrong with that as well. So I hope you guys enjoyed taking a look at this current listing. And again, if you have any questions about this listing, uh, feel free to let me know. I am gonna include a link to this listing so you can see some of the photos um, as well and get some more info. And of course you can contact me to get that info as well. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video on taking a closer look at the Bluffs on the Waterway. This is one of the most desirable communities here in the Grand Strand with its top-notch amenities and of course having access to the intercoastal waterway with its own boat ramp and private boat storage as well. So if you have any questions about this community, want to take a closer look at any of the listings or the listing I featured in today's video, feel free to reach out. Again, all my information is in the description below you can give me a call, text, or email, or schedule one-on-one -on -one consultation. Um, there's a lot of other communities I could definitely recommend if you're looking for that intercoastal lifestyle. Uh, but I hope you guys enjoyed today's video by giving this video a big thumbs up and subscribing to the channel to stay up to date on everything going on in the Myrtle Beach area. But I hope you guys have a wonderful day, and don't forget to keep on enjoying that Myrtle Beach lifestyle. I'll see you guys next time.